Hi, I'm Philip Jones in the Jones Family Kitchen. I'm here today to show you how to carve a holiday ham. This can be one of the most challenging things you have to contend with at the holiday season. The first thing you have to do is look at the orientation of the ham and understand where the shank is and where the femur bone is. The next thing you have to do is have a really sharp knife because if you don't have a sharp knife, it makes the job of carving a ham much tougher than it really is. So to begin with, we're going to take a carving fork and identify the shank end and the butt end. And here on this side, you will see I'm going to stick the knife in. I'm going to find the, the bone right here, which is what we want to do. We want to know where that leg bone is for the ham. The next thing I'm going to do is take a face slice off of this part of the ham so that we can stand it on end like this. And that's really a beautiful Jones fully cooked bone-in holiday ham. So now that I have found where to stand the ham on edge, I'm going to begin carving straight down like this, making a wedge cut at the shank end of the ham. And you can see that first slice will come out like that. And then we are ready to begin carving the ham for your holiday table. We like to recommend thin slices, but some people might prefer thick slices and you can do whatever you like. And you continue throughout the ham just like that and there you have it. Very easy way, simple orientation of the ham, and that'll make your, your carving at this holiday season a little bit easier, a little less stressful. I hope you enjoy it.